Hey YouTube, welcome back. So today I'm going to unbox uh, this. This one's the GEVCC Smart LED uh, Floor Lamp. It is a RGBIC Smart Modern uh, 50 inch corner floor lamp with the uh, Alexa, Google Assistant, and a Wi-Fi app, DIY and uh, 21 CMO. It also uh, sync with the music. So this lamp is uh, great for uh, living room, bedroom, gaming room, kitchen, restroom, wherever you want to put this uh, at your home or uh, office. So yeah, I'd like to give a shout out to uh, Sunny from their marketing team for sending me this so I could uh, unbox it and do the review for you guys and then uh, set up. This one has a uh, four way to control, either app control, remote control, voice control with the Alexa or a Google Assistant and uh, three keys uh, control. It is uh, dimmable and uh, easy to install. So yeah, let's go ahead and unbox it. So here's the product description. So yeah, be sure to check out the link that's going to show you within the description so you can get, uh, check it out. Corner floor lamp, YSJ. Scan to download app. Here's the specification. So it is uh, made in Shenzhen, uh, China. So this is the base, it is uh, weighted. And it comes with the remote control. Be sure to pull out this uh, plastic clear tab so your remote could work. Let's see uh, what kind of battery this one is. So this one's the CR two zero two five three volt. And uh, here's the instruction. The app's called the Smart Life uh, app. Here's the AC to DC adapter. It's a 5 volt at 3 amp. And the input could be 110 to up to 250 volt AC, 50 uh, or 60 hertz. And here's the controller. So I guess uh, you press this uh, three button and I'm check it out. So there's a on and off button right here. And then the mode and then the music. So 
So you need to uh, connect right here for the power source. And then uh, this is the infrared. Be sure not to cover this so you could uh, control it. They also come with this uh, tiny uh, Allen screw and also the Allen tool. And this is very lightweight aluminum, so it's uh, pretty light. And then there's a LED in there. So make sure to plug is facing the sticker on the back, okay? And it is number, this one is second, and then third. So they have a pin right here. Be sure to insert in there so you can have a good connection. And uh, you want to test it out before you screw it in. Make sure uh, all the sections are working. So the third one has a cover on the top, so I know it's the top. Let me go ahead and uh, plug it in. Gonna turn off the light since I only have uh, one plug. Wow, there you go. That's uh, working with the wrist remote first. Turn it off. Let's uh, turn it off on the button right here. So this, this is on. And uh, I press the M for a mode. Pretty cool. And then I'm gonna press uh, M. For, that's for the music. Let me play uh, some, my song and see. All right. Turn it off. So with this uh, remote, uh, there's a mode, plus and minus, and then uh, there's a speed, plus and minus, and then the uh, brightness or dimmer. It's a uh, red, green, blue, and all the preset uh, color here, you can lock it. And then there's a uh, music one and music two. Let's go and check it out. And then uh, there's an auto. Let me press auto. So auto it will change uh, different uh, varieties of uh, different colors. And you get the uh, press the speed. 
to go faster. Let's go and then test our red, green, blue, yellow. And then W is the white color. And then there's a color here. So I press uh, each time you change a different uh, individual color. We can lock it so nobody could uh, change color. This is uh, music one. Hello, 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 hello. Hey, YouTube. Let's go and check out music two. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, wow, look at that. This is, a vo uh, I guess, a music too. Cool. Let's go and then uh, finish installing with the screw. Let's go and then uh, test on the corner light and stuff. Okay, so I uh, unplug and plug it back in. This is the syncing mode to the app, so you need to download the smart light app uh, first. All right, so I'm going to go to my uh, Google uh, Play Store and then uh, search Smart Life. This one right here. And then uh, you're gonna click on uh, install. Uh, since I already installed already, uh, just uh, click on enable. So I will need to update. So normally you will need to register if you're a new account holder. And be sure to uh, turn on your uh, Wi-Fi. And it is only compatible with the 2.4 gigahertz uh, Wi-Fi, not 5G. And then uh, also enable your uh, Bluetooth. All right, so I'm going to click on open. So right here, you need to uh, sign up or log in. Make sure you click on I agree. And then uh, you're going to get the verification uh, code through your email. Make sure it is uh, correct. So uh, Bluetooth and location, just uh, press uh, continue while using the app, allowed. So you need to uh, click on the plus sign on the upper right hand side, add device. Make sure it's uh, 2.4 gigahertz. So you need to select your device. So it says uh, discovering a device. Let's say click on add. 
So it'll be this one right here, the second one on the bottom. Click on Add. So now it's uh, try to add. Okay, successful. And then you click uh, click on the pens right here. You could edit the name. Let's say uh, gaming room. And then press done. Oh, you just uh, click on done on the upper right hand side. Confirm. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and search Smart Life. And uh, Game Room is already on. I'm gonna tap on Game Room. Okay, there's a uh, quiet. This is the film. These are the preset. Dating. Sunset. Christmas Eve. And then uh, right next to the quiet in the midsection, there's an active. And you could click on uh, romantic. Colorful. Dynamic. Dream. And uh, right next to uh, active, there's a uh, marquee. You gotta click on uh, rainbow or uh, flowing uh, water. And then uh, on the bottom right here, this is the music. So you could click on uh, rhythm. Test, test, testing, one, two, three. And then uh, there's a bar right there. You could click on the bar. You could click on the speed right here. And then uh, sensitivity. Earlier that was a uh, jazz. Testing, test, 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 test. And then right next to the jazz on the left hand side, there's a rock. Yo, yo, testing one, two, three, you two. How do you like this light? And then uh, we're gonna stick to, uh, stick to uh, classic. And now it's the classic, classic. Can you see? Pretty awesome. We're gonna go and then uh, click on the roll. Testing, 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 testing. And right here is uh, uh, anti-clockwise. I guess it's from the top to bottom. You could uh, click on clockwise and it goes uh, opposite direction. Testing, one, two, three, yes, yes. So if you don't like the automatic uh, color, you can switch it off. And then right here, you could uh, customize your own color by dragging the color field to whatever color that you like. Yellow, blue, pink, or oh, that's like a purple, pink, or oh, still purple. Or orange, yellowish. You can select to the right one. And then I'm gonna click on the energy. This is the energy right here. How do you like that? Again, you could uh, change your color automatic to off, and then you could just uh, drag whatever color you like. Wow. And then this, uh, the last one is under music will be the spectrum. This is the spectrum, yo. And again, you could uh, change the speed. Testing one, two, three, so it doesn't go as uh, high up there. Testing, testing, test, test, test. And again, uh, you could turn it off. Just uh, drag the each color that you like. And then uh, this one, this one is pretty cool. Right now it's all uh, white color right now and you could uh, customize it by uh, switching the color that you want. And you must uh, click on the preview 
in order to change it. Click on plus save scene if you like the scene. And each individual section right here, you could uh, switch to off or customize whatever color that you want it to be. Okay, and then after that, I can press preview. And as you can see, it's mixed with the uh, two colors right now. You can mix a uh, three color or ho however color that you want to mix it with. Or color transition on and off and press preview. Okay, and then the last one is the one on the right hand side. Right here is the timer. You can set it a uh, one minute timer or up to, uh, what is it, 24 hours. So I'm gonna set it to one minute and then it should just uh, shut up by itself. And then uh, over here, the schedule right there, you could uh, click on add. You can select what time you want the lights to be turned on. Normally I like to set it around like uh, 8 p.m. Okay. And uh, I do that um, every day. And right here, I can switch to on or off. I'm going to turn it on and then confirm. So now the light is going to come on at 8 o'clock. And then you can save it. And now you see the schedule is on there. I can click on one more. Now I'm going to turn the lights at 10 o'clock. Uh, now it's uh, the one minute timer is uh, set. So right here you must uh, select off and confirm and then uh, click on save on the upper right hand side. So now it shows, uh, oh shoot, I forgot to put it uh, every day on the off. I can just go in there, go in there and then click on every day and then click on save again. Okay. Let me turn it back on. So yeah, anyway, uh, hopefully you guys uh, give a thumbs up, like the video. Please uh, be sure to uh, hit the subscribe button, turn on that bell for notification, or drop any other comments on below. And thank you for watching. I'll see you guys on the next uh, video, like always. Peace.